Hey guys, Stasis here. Today we're going to be playing some more Conan and Exiles. Don't forget, if you like the videos and the series, to hit the like button and subscribe for more. Okay, so we did quite a bit in the last few episodes. Um, we've been out, we've adventured, um, found some cool places. I have been saying for a while that I was going to finish off this back bit of the base and do some stuff. So that's kind of what I've worked on. I've also built some stairs up here. Now, the building has been a bit funky, so it's all a bit random at the moment, but we will sort it probably a bit later on. Um, I kind of have a plan to make it look better, but for now, this is what we have. So um, it didn't want to go up and round for some reason. I don't know why, <laughs> but it didn't. Um, so what we've done is we've widened out this patio area here we have walled it off around here um, and then when we bring the throws back across we can now bring them up this ramp here so we don't have to worry about getting them back to base so we've got that um, like I say we've got the stairs that go up to the roof there last episode we moved the uh, wheel of pain in here so that's good um, we've got Throws, we've got arches on the roof and I think I'm going to put some arches up on this roof here. Um, I think that will be my plan at some point. So yeah, um, it kind of looks a bit better now. Um, has a bit more of a bassy feel to it. There's definitely stuff that needs to be done. But like I said, I keep getting distracted. So um, I'll have to work on getting that done. And also, now that this is in stone brick, I really want to move this to stone brick. So we need to get on that at some point as well. Um, but for now, this is as it, how it is. So what I want to do is to go and see if I can get that entertainer. I'm a bit of a high level, got some better armor. I've got some health potions on me. I really want to see if I can get that thrall and get it back here. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be right back while I run over there. Um, and then I'll see you in a second. And hopefully we will be able to get this entertainer. So be right back, guys. Hey guys, we are back. Uh, I really hate this guy. I just... <laughs> I feel like there is no way to get around him without him making you bleed. And now my buttons aren't working because I'm on a hill. Um, it's really tough. I'm not gonna lie. He just doesn't. He doesn't give in. Apparently, I'm bugged out and I can't kick. Okay, it's all about the timing. We did it. Okay, we did it. We did it. <laughs> it's not as hard as it looks. I was doing it wrong all this time. <laughs> we got the entertainer. And that is what is important. So, um, what I didn't mention, as I just got there, is that obviously I've taken out the archer and the, um, the guy that guards the entrance of it. Um, that was the first thing I did. And then it was trying to deal with that entertainer, which we have managed to do. So... <laughs> I took a battering to my gear and my shields and my health before I even got to the entertainer as I'm sure you can tell by my health bar um, and my well the amount of health potions I left with <laughs> and the shape shape of my shield um, yeah so anyway I'm excited <laughs> a little bit I've been after that guy for so long and I know he's only a level one but it was just the whole bleeding thing I was really struggling with it so oh no my bridge has gone down no I don't think it has okay it hasn't gone down I'm just being so stupid that I can't even get across here it's the excitement <laughs> oh but okay I'm so glad we've got this guy. So this should be a lot easier now because I love the way he's just like lying flat on his back with his arms out in the air like da 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 da. Oh, sorry, dude. 
No one said it was going to be, you know, a nice trip here. We did it! We have a Hycranian dancer. I'm so happy with that. Right, so you can, like, just sit in there and get beaten up. You deserve it after all that effort. It's a good start to the episode, guys. We've got the entertainer that we've been after for so long. <laughs> right. I'd say that that's enough taming of Thrills, but it's really not because I need to get archers. Um, the annoying thing is there was a level two archer in that camp that would have been really nice to have. But yeah, just like having to, to get through that bit. Do you know what though? As I'm sat here, I'm sure you can probably tell, as I'm sat here thinking about this, I'm kind of feeling like I want to go back because I know that there is, you know, another one in that camp. Hmm. Do we go back? Should we just, should we just go in and see what happens? Let's let's just go. Let's go. There's a, I know there's an archer like on a ledge. You see, like just a bit further back. And now I've taken those guys out. It seems like the perfect opportunity to go for it. My only thing is, you can only fit one thrall in a wheel of pain at a time, right? I'm sure. Hmm. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Do you know what? Let's leave it. We'll go back once this one's in because I'm pretty sure from playing on multiplayer that I can only fit one in at a time. Um, I don't want to ruin that because I'll bring it back and then I'll just have to keep knocking it out and it'll be really annoying. It's fine. We will go back because I know that there are obviously archers and stuff in there. So that's fine. We'll go back to that camp. Uh, right. On a side note, there are other things that we probably should be doing. Um, I need to go and get some thick leather, is what I need to do, because they've changed how you, what it takes to craft things. Um, and this armour that I'm wearing at the moment actually needs thick hide. I can't remember if it needed thick hide or not before. Maybe it did and I did get some. But um, I need to go and get some more of that. So I definitely need to go on a farm for that because I need to actually repair this armour. Um, and I was going to go and have a mooch around as well. Um, now that we're going to have this entertainer, corruption zones are enterable. Um, and seeing as I've got some corruption already, it would make sense just to go and do it. So I'm going to be right back. I'm going to go find some stuff and then I will pull you back in when I'm back. So we'll be right back, guys. Hey, everyone. We're back. Uh, so this was the corruption zone that I was on about. Uh, I got into some fights on my way here like I always do. <laughs> Ran across the camp with spiders and throws, got some stuff. Um, yeah, we'll see what we can do. I, I kind of just want to run through here. I don't know how the whole corruption thing works really, but I, I'm gonna guess that it kills me at some point. Okay, well this, this, this is interesting stuff. We're gonna keep sending them. Whoa! This was probably a very bad place to come. This is a technique, guys. It's called make a break for it. And sometimes there are occasions where you just have to run. This is one of them. I know what you were going to say, I'm a wimp. Yes. Yes, I am. It all descends. 
<laughs> I found a ball! <laughs> Why am I here? Okay, well. Now I know where that goes. I discovered the sun pit thing, but like from above. <laughs> I found a dragon. <laughs> I have got to stop just running into stuff. <laughs> it's not good. <laughs> Although it is quite entertaining. <laughs> okay, so. Very much do not need to go in there. Um. Yeah. <laughs> that was a little bit crazy. I managed to beat the thing. Don't really know what that did for me because I was running away. But you know, I need to level up. I keep saying this. Um, I now have light corruption, whatever that means. I'm assuming that will just maybe slowly kill me over time. Who knows? Um, it's fine because we have the dancer that we are taming up here so yes yes we need more aloe leaves more and more because i like to get myself into sticky situations okay so yeah i think we need to reevaluate what i should do next really <laughs> Probably should do some stuff on the base <laughs> and get some more archers rather than trying to run in to some crazy dragon boss. I'm gonna be right back because uh, my next plan is to maybe go and grab an archer once this entertainment is done. So be right back, guys. Hey guys, we're back. Um, so I went out for a run in the rain foresty area and I found a rhino. So we managed to get some of this, uh, thick hide, some rhino hide and another horn. Um, the one that I was fighting, um, actually glitched out a little bit. So I guess in a sense made our life a little bit easier. Um, now... I'm going to do that. I think that that might make us some more thick hide, maybe? Yeah, cool. Okay, so we make some more. Now, that should mean that I should be able to now repair all of this armour. So if I go ahead and pop this in here. And there's something really exciting that I want to show you guys as well because obviously now that our entertainer is all up and, and ready um, is actually tamed so hopefully I don't know if you guys have noticed but since I've come back obviously my um, corruption is gone from my health bar now you see that so yeah we've got the entertainer and it's all worked out good cool Right, so that's all repaired, and how much have we got left? Nah, not too much. We'll probably have to go out again at some point and do that. Um, but yeah, so here's the entertainer. I'll just pop them in here for now. Um, they're just in the corner dancing away. But yeah, so corruption is cleansed. Job done. Um, still, however, do need to obviously get an archer. Why is my frost hatchet in there? Oh, I'm so confused. Where is it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> that was random. Um, so yeah, we need to... I really need to get on it with the archers um, and then make that into stone brick. So I think that's probably what I'm going to spend most of next episode doing now that we've got the armour repaired. We've got an entertainer. Um, so yeah, I'm probably going to spend most of that episode... Um, the next episode, sorry. Um, 
upgrading and you know taming some some archers so that we can get our whole little army going um i'm a bit conscious that although the purge bar isn't moving particularly fast um it definitely is moving and that concerns me <laughs> so i really need to do some stuff around the base and get that sorted um the other thing for you guys um if you need thick hide i got it off rhinos um and i actually found rhinos in this location just over here um so yeah if you run this is where we are if you run down like this way um oh actually there's there's one here too because i died here so yeah around this area um is where you'll find some some thick hides and some rhinos and stuff so just pop in there um that's what i found easiest for me obviously depending on your location you'll i'm sure you'll find other places um elephants can give it as well not really equipped to deal with that yet um what i need to do is make myself a pike and i remember saying that we were going to do that and try that out and then i still haven't done it so that's something that we need to look into uh, when did i learn that um i think we can make a stone pipe there but i'm pretty sure if i check the blacksmith we might actually let's pop up here just for a sec and let's have a quick look at what we can make pike wise we've got that which isn't that great with that iron pike iron core so i think i'm gonna go for this um i'm gonna have to get some more branch to do that What does this do? Make tools more efficient. Should we craft one of them? And then we need eight branch apparently to make this thing. So let's just quickly pop over here. See if we can get eight branch really quick and make just to finish the episode on a high we've repaired our armour and okay so I think we have enough so if we just pop back excuse me coming through well that's the other thing I need to do as well is armour reduce this armour that I'm wearing because I haven't done that yet so let's make that i don't know i think some of these are like throwable and others Oh, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to damage you. Okay. Let's just go outside a minute. This looks cool. So we can attack like this, or we can jabbity jab, jab, jab. Hmm, this may come in very handy. <laughs> okay, cool. So, oh, that was a bit strange. We now have a pike, which is cool. Um, definitely probably gonna use that. It's just trying to keep stuff going at the same time as doing other stuff. Um, cool, so yeah. That's really cool. Uh, I think I may have left my sword. My cutlass in there. So let's have a look. Damage wise, this one does 22 is probably going to do less yet, 19 but armor penetrates more and it has a reach so 
yeah, I think we're gonna go with this and see how we get on with it. Um, should be able to count modifier items that are damaged. Oh, okay. Well, my bad. I don't really know what that did. It doesn't appear to have changed its stats, but hey. That's cool. We will go with that. Okay, cool. So you can like reduce the weight. We have so many things that I need to look into. Anyway, I'm probably going to leave this episode here on the basis that we've made a pipe, I uh, managed to get some rhino hide and so out my armour, we got an entertainer, um, yeah we've done quite a little bit so I am going to work some more on the base, um, I'm going to try and fix those stairs on that tower over there, I need to get all this whole stone brick things sorted, um, but yeah, if you like the videos don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe and check out the youtube channel as a whole um follow me on twitter at stasels905 and until next time we will catch you later catch you later <laughs>